Yes, you don't know. Trips is here again. Yeah, Trips is here.
Jaja Farm. My name is Ganyo Kazira Larawaju, MDCU, Plant Integrated Global Resources. Let's take you to our farm. These are the West African Dwarf, the local ward. We have the red chocoto goats. Then we have the sire. We have the common bukolo cow. So this is the free place for them to play. That is the playing ground. So let's take it to our pen now. So this is the pen for our arms. These are the wood, the plain white, the local door camps. So these are the these are the chicken, the trays of free range, just to beautify the farm. These are local wild on free range, the Sahel, the Red Shokoto mixed together. So the aim is to cross the Red Shokoto with the dwarf goats. So as to get something different, a new breed that will be taller than the normal ward that we commonly have here. So that is why we're mixing the ward and the red chocoto goats. So have something different. So these are coffee section, these are the local coffees. They are on free range. They are on free range. They are not commercializing them though. It's just for us to have something to kill at the end of the year and as a gift to our customers. So So these are the sheep and the newborn. We have them here, and we we'll put them in a separate pen so as to give them more space and time to eat. Then give the lamp and the, the, and the baby to grow so there won't be any issue with them. So let's go to the next pair now. These are some of our sheep too. These are some of our sheep. Okay. This is a special um, stadium breed. We use it for crossing, so not the regular ones. So what breed? Chad breed. Chad breed. Yeah. So we use it for breeding. So these are some of our mirror arms. For Salad December sales. Salad December sales? Yeah. Salad is next year, December, Christmas, New Year. So. Let's take it to where our. Yeah, where our. This is the Bukolo cow. Very friendly. So we have a back here where our rams, the dwarf, where they breed. So we have maize plantation here. So we plant this maize basically for them. You can see some of them there. So they are just grazing. So they graze naturally on the on the maize. So this this is where they graze. And we still have some extension at the back too. 
So you're welcome to Jaja Farms. This is Jaja Farms. Thank you. So, um, talking about farming business, um, the most important thing you have to look into is, first of all, you have to look at the, um, the farmland, get a very stable place for your animals. Then, uh, most importantly, you have to prepare ahead for the, um, for the food, because um, feeding is the most, is, is, is the paramount thing in animals, in keeping animals. When you can get a feeding solution, I think that's the whole thing. When we started the business, we had issues with feedings of the animals, but thank God we've been able to overcome that. So um, we're always available to give you more hints on how to do your farm business. So on animal husbandry, there's no problem. Don't want to start the, the, the business. Don't look at the profit immediately. You have to look at getting a very young, sharp breed for you to keep in a farm. When you get old animals in your farm, it's not going to be productive at the end of the day because by the time they give birth to like two, three times, that's the end. And sometimes, even if they give birth, they'll be giving birth to still birth. So you have to look at the young, sharp animals to start with. If you look at our wild there, they are very still young. Those are started. So most of them are, if they're giving birth, that's the first, that's going to be their first birth. So don't look at making profit immediately. So it's, it's, it's a business for a long-term business. So we got a puzzle. So if you have any issues, Contact us, no problem. Just go to IG Jaja Contacts. We are there, or Jaja Farms. We are there. Follow us, eat us up. So, guys, we're done for today. Here is my it's friends, good. and here is the owner of the farm. You can see him. He has explained everything. And if you need anything, any information, you want to buy ram, you want to buy cow, or anything like that, just contact him i'm gonna put his um, ig link in the description box you can just contact him and if you don't want to contact him directly let me know i'm gonna get in touch with him so thank you so much for watching don't forget to like subscribe share i'm gonna see you in the next video have a wonderful day bye